Uh, my name is Thomas Dixon. Um, I just graduated with my Master's of Education in Educational Psychology from uh, Temple University um, from Philadelphia. Uh, I'm a secular humanist and I'm openly secular. Mm. I think it happened as I was going through middle school and then high school and I started to find it strange that in other areas of my life I wouldn't believe in something without the ability to try and see if it was true or false. So the fact that um, a faith view was undisprovable, it was untestable. The scientists in me did not align with that, so to speak, and that's why I decided that I would become uh, secular. For me personally, um, from, it's that I feel it's random, that I happen to be born male, that I happen to be born white, and so I act towards other people that the way that they were born was also random and I could have been in their shoes, so approach them in the way that I would hope to be approached by someone. Fortunately, not so strongly discriminated against. Made to feel uncomfortable at times, sure. Um, weird things too that people may not know, such as the in God we trust on our money, and that only happened later in American history, not earlier. So those sort of issues and awareness of such happening as a result. If I go to a gathering, a larger family gathering, for example, many relatives, um, or a friend's house, a family gathering at their place, and they, about before they're going to eat, uh, let's pray. And then I have to hold my hands down and go, you know, count one Mississippi, two Mississippi, <laughs> and sort of just wait for the moment to pass. Not bring up a huge argument or a fight, obviously, but let moments pass like that. Yeah, or after my accident, when I was hit by the car, that they, um, people told me that they would pray for me. And rather than get into a huge discussion of, I don't know what the utility of that would be, say, thanks for thinking of me. That's how I decided to go about it. You will, you will be treated some way, somehow, no matter what in your life. And none is a choice that you can make if that's what you're choosing to have no other views. Um, partly that's why I enjoy the label humanist and embracing that rather than atheist or agnostic. I feel weird in that way because we're defined by a negative. It makes no sense. Uh, I don't walk around saying I'm a non-woman, um, for example. I, I'm defined as something else. So I think um, having a label and a group identity will help other than one that is defining in a negative. I think any extent of other, so to speak, other beliefs, other views, may change society in that it would have to become more standard, more comfortable with differences among individuals and groups on um, the same way that um, perhaps uh, the acceptance of homosexuality in our culture has caused that to happen.